Hey everybody, Case here, and welcome to the Alice in Wonderland update in Family Gather Quest for Stuff. So this is obviously going to be a parody take on Alice in Wonderland, and I don't know what all this is. I'm scared to tap anything, so I think the best thing I should do, my best course of action, is you tap the quest. Oh my god, have you seen this? Alright Stewie, it's bedtime. I'm going to read you Alice in Wonderland, even though I'm not feeling so well. Ugh, great. If you're sick, that means I'll probably end up getting sick too. Do me a favor. If I do get sick, please don't put vapor rub on my chest. It's really erotic, and I'm already very concerned about the psychological problems I'm gonna grow up with. Hey, my mom used to do that when I was a little kid. Vapor rub is very good for you. Learn about Lois in Wonderland, Chris Dawn a new hat. But she's got a new hat. Brace yourselves, cause I have got big news! I heard there are some foods in Wonderland that can make you bigger or smaller. Is that true? Why yes! If you eat Wonderland cookies, you'll get bigger. And if you eat Wonderland celery, you'll get smaller. That just sounds like different diets. It may sound like a diet, but the Wonderland Fit Fam is so much more. It's a community. Now, let's get you signed up for one month free subscription that is impossible to cancel. I remember when I was a lot younger, I went to join a gym, and they gave me like a contract or whatever, and I couldn't get out of it, so I said, oh, I'm moving, and they still wouldn't get out of it, and I had to try to give them like proof and stuff, I was like, oh man. Earn Alice Lois! Yep. Jeez, I didn't think eating all that food would upset my stomach, but I was wrong. Why can't I stop myself when it comes to food? Because you have no self-control, Peter. Yes, I do. I have great self-control when it comes to not working too much, or too hard, or at all, some days. Mad Hatter Peter! So go back to this, let's learn about the, the update. White Rabbit Brian! That's amazing looking. That's probably the premium character. Uh, okay, let's see if we can figure out what we gotta do. First of all, it's gonna be a three-week update. Second of all, time to get emotional. Use emotion potions to get cool stuff from the shop. Tap on diamond cart soldiers to clear them and get emotional potions and white roses. Don't slow down to feed Caterpillar Joe to get emotion potions and pawns. Oh boy! The four-hour quest. <laughs> wow, the cold medicine is making me drowsy. Yeah, right. Cold medicine. Just because medicine is sometimes grape flavored, doesn't mean you're allowed to call wine medicine. Well, why not? Hey, I got a potion. This place is a nut house. What? Where am I? Why, you're in Wonderland. Michael Jackson's house? No, that's Neverland Ranch. Wonderland is a place of whimsy. Although, there have been a few accusations here as well. Please don't drink anything the March Hare gives you. Learned about exploration, that took a turn. Unlock Hippity Hop Watch Repair and jump down the rabbit hole. I don't know what that is. Is that like an actual new area? Learn about explorations. Choose the rooms you wish to send your characters to. Complete explorations to spawn card soldiers and Caterpillar Joe. So can we actually go into these places, or is it just like, okay, these characters go to these areas and they just drop things. Or in this case, spawn things. Look at everything in a bit better detail, of course I don't want to tap those. Where is the rabbit hole? Maybe I should look at the picture! Maybe I should look at the picture, so it is over here. Okay, so I still need... Two more of the hats, unfortunately, and I know it was from one character. Who was it? It was Chris, but there's also Mort, Meg, Bonnie. And these are four-hour quests for all these, I believe. Can I help you? Probably. And I dropped the emo the, uh, the emotion, sorry. Oh my! Emotion potions, and I have eleven. We've also got hippity hop watch repair, and I need forty of the emotion potions in order to actually get this to go. And in order to get all of them, there's from defeating Caterpillar Joe, Explorations, 
clearing diamond card soldiers, and then Alice in Wonderland characters as well. At least potions from the diamond card soldiers. Can I tap it? Oh, I see. Chance of... Alright, uh, yeah, yeah, that's what they're saying, yeah. So we gotta send them off here, then they'll spawn, and you tap them, they'll, I think they'll drop the potions as well. There's a whole slew of way to get the different potions. Inventory-wise, we've got the White Rabbit Brian, which looks really awesome, by the way. We've got the different hats. There's the Hippity Hop Watch Repair Shop. Mad Tea Party. Door Tree, which drops. It looks like some kind of, like, brass doorknob or something. Mushroom Forest. Curious Sir's Curiosity Shop. And just kind of keeps going. Those are the two characters there. And thankfully, neither of them are timed. So Mad Hatter, Peter, three rare bow ties from going down the rabbit hole. Remember, you gotta get those hats first from all those different characters. Two of them, then you can send Peter off and actually do that. Is it Peter? Let's just double check. Yep, right there. We well, got the uh, the pocket watches. 13 uncommon Bonnie and Hippity Hop watch repair shop, which is what I'm working on. Right there. I'm just having fun. Eight hours? Uh, let's go back to the Hippity Hop repair shop for a second. Oh yeah, it costs 40. Is that this thing here? Okay, yeah, so you do all the different items here from the shop. And finally, we got the teacups. Five common, Joe and Bruce. Boy. At four hours each. As for Alice Lois, at the chess pieces. How many chess pieces? Giant chessboard and caterpillar Joe. I don't know what the top thing is. Oh, that's premium. Find Caterpillar Joe in the Mad Hat Tea Party. What? I don't think they're gonna actually pop up until later on in the quest line. In fact, I'm gonna double check that afterwards just to make sure, but I'm pretty sure I just have to continue on in the main quest line here in order to actually get to Caterpillar Joe to pop up. These are brass doorknobs, right? Or copper. Doorknobs, whatever. Herbert, Joe. Door tree, which I know I think is from the craftable items. Hey, little man. Eight hours. How many white roses? Twelve? Twenty-two, but twelve is like a dozen. Everybody always gets a dozen roses. It's not a dozen roses, and it's not even two dozen. It's twenty-two. Go down the rabbit hole, which I'm doing, but I still gotta get those hats. Remember, get those hats. All these characters here. The final item is, I'm not sure what it is. What is it? Magic dust in the rare. I thought they would be extra rare because it's got like the, uh, the whitish, goldish like, outline. Curiouser's Curiosity Shop, which is the second last at the very, very bottom there. And you're probably going to have to get all six of these items as well. Caterpillar Joe, here we go. How do I battle Caterpillar Joe? Once you complete Down the Rabbit Hole Part 4 of the main quest line, then the battle will be available. Okay, because I'm only on part number two. So always leave, you know, make sure you continue the main quest line as well. Try to get the hatch so you can send Peter down the rabbit hole hour and a half, and it does drop a whole bunch of different things. The motion potion for the crafting, bow ties for Manhattan Peter, the, the diamond card dude, I think they drop potions as well. And then of course, when you get to part number four, Caterpillar Joe will pop up, you can do the bailing, and that drops different things as well. So, let me know what you think so far of this update. Looks kind of fun, actually. I really like Alice in Wonderland. I played it in the Disney Magic Kingdoms game a while back, and it was a lot of fun. But we'll see what happens in the Lois in Wonderland update and Family Gather Quest for Stuff. So if you enjoy Family Gather Quest for Stuff, and you enjoy Alice in Wonderland, this could be a nice group of of videos to subscribe to if you're not subscribed because there's going to be a three week update on this we're going to get some pretty cool characters and of course this is a particular game where they're always doing different parodies of different things and some of them are actually really really fun and really really clever so thank you everybody so much for watching and i will see you on the next one
Bye-bye.